ChatGPT versus Gemini. Today I'm forcing both AIs to make plants versus zombies from scratch in 30 minutes. Per usual, ChatGPT gave me a nice and detailed prompt. So I'm gonna copy this, paste this into the new ChatGPT. I also have thinking enabled. With that being said, let's send this and start the 30 minute timer. Oh, okay, just finished. Um, we're like almost seven minutes in. Okay, roughly 1600 lines. Let's give it a run. Dude, this looks like a scratch game. Oh, brother, what? They're in like every lane. How is this even supposed to be possible? And where where are the lawnmowers, bro? There's no lawnmowers. So that makes it even harder. Okay, so I think if I if I kill the rest of these guys, I'm gonna win, but I just can't do that. It's literally impossible. Add lawnmowers to each row with the same functionality as PVC. Add more plants and variation. Add more worlds and make the spawning system for the zombies or mouse. It should take another six or seven minutes to generate this code. Hopefully it makes the game right better. I, I, I literally just can't get over how like how much this reminds me of a scratch game. But I think we have to give ChatGPT some credit here. It was able to one-shot this with no errors. <laughs> All right, it's finally generating the code again. Oh, okay. So it's adding a new world here. Moonlit garden. Like that, like that. And we also got a rainy world. Oh, and that's it. Just added two more worlds. Oh, man, that's pretty lame. Guys, we did reach our goal of 67,000 subscribers today, actually. Well, the day I'm recording this. My life is complete. I right, say less. It's done. Finally, we have nine minutes to go. So we'll be able to get one or two more iterations out of this. But for now, let's paste the new code in. Okay, it added like 250 lines. It's definitely not a whole lot, but... So this looks like the same exact game. We do have two new worlds. Um, frick it. Let's, uh, let's do world three. We have our lawnmowers now. Let's go. You know, perhaps it could make these icons at the top a little bit more detailed. Oh, I think I know what these are, actually. This is definitely the cherry bomb, and this is definitely the um, frozen pea shooter. So let's... Yeah. Yeah, it's frozen pea shooter. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's sick. He gets, he gets like a little glow effect when he gets hit with it. I honestly, bro, I think it made the spawn system harder. Maybe it misinterpreted what I meant by making it more balanced. Maybe it thought it was too easy. I don't know. Oh, the lawnmower. It works. Yes. Oh, shoot. I, I just won. Oh my god, wait, the game might be way too easy now. All right, let's see what World 4 is all about. It seems like the same exact thing, eh? I think the best strat is to just farm sunflowers. Okay, we're gonna have to place a pea shooter right here to get rid of this guy. Place another one right here to get that guy. I think we just won. Yes, sir. We did it. Make the plant icons work to add more fun zombie variants. Make the menu screen look cooler and look out. Oh, timer's up. Oh, it's still generating the code and the freaking timer went off. All right, this is the last iteration. Okay, add like another 200 lines. This is a much better menu screen. I'll give it that. Got the animated clouds. Oh, okay, yeah, and the icons are more detailed now. It's literally just the sprites. What am I seeing here? Spade. Oh, is this um the shovel? I can just shovel up plants. Oh, okay. I, I don't think that was a good play, but it works. What is this? The freak is that? What? The, what is this? Why is? I didn't know there was like a yellow pea shooter. Oh, this level is so free! Holy crap! This guy is just gonna die to this lawnmower. Boom! Level complete. I'm the goat. All right, nothing new with World Two. Get me out of here. Let's try World Four. I don't even think I tried this last time. This is supposed to be the rainy level, but I'm not seeing any like rain particle effects or anything. Okay. Well, let's farm some sun while we're at it. Yeah, I definitely got the strat here. Farm as much sun as possible early on, and then. We can bring out the troops. Whoa, what is this guy? Freaking wearing armor and stuff. That was cool. I never saw that zombie yet. Oh, we won. Well, that's going to wrap it up for ChatGPT. What a fun game. What a cool game. whoop de doo Let's paste in the prompt for Gemini now. And I guess we can freaking enable the canvas. Yeah, sounds good. Let's send that. 30 minute timer, begin. Wait, it's calling it... It's calling it Backyard Guard. ChatGPT's was called Backyard Zombie Defense, and it's calling it Backyard Guard. I kind of like that, I kind of like that, to be honest. But yeah, you gotta remember, uh, Gemini's a lot quicker with it. Yeah, Gemini's already at 700 lines of code, and we're not even two minutes in. So it, it is so fast compared to GPT, it's kind of insane. It's done, oh my gosh. All right, before we play it, let's copy the entire code and paste it into our HTML document. So we can have a nice full screen gaming experience. Play it. Oh, here we are. It actually doesn't even take up the full like web screen. What the freak? Bro, it's so fast. What is up with this? Why is it like... 
All right, bro. Thanks a lot. Maybe level two is a little better. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, it just sped up so fast. All right, all right, all right. We just got to tell it to make it frame rate independent so the game runs the same speed on every computer. Make the game frame rate independent. Also, what is up with this? Why is it like off centered? Fix the centering of the game. The grid where the gameplay takes place is more so in the top right rather than center. It should be centered. Yeah, we'll just send that for now. Um, I just want to see what this looks like when it works properly. New code. Boom. Okay. Now we're at 1,096 lines of code. What a drastic change to the game. Let's see how it looks. Is this perfectly centered? You know, I'd argue that the centering is kind of off. To me, it looks like the left side is like smaller than the right side. Like, it looks like there's more room on the right side, but it's not a big deal. What am I even saying? Let me place this walnut. <laughs> Goofy I wanna, bro. Yo, this game is very much more like animated and um fun than ChatGPT's version, I feel like. And, and it forgot to add lawnmowers, just like ChatGPT, which makes me wonder if the prompt didn't include lawnmowers. Might have been a good idea to check the prompt before I sent it. Add lawn mowers to the game for each row. Same functionality as PVZ. More detailed icons, more plants, more zombies, more fun. Alright. Let's uh give this new version a shot. Huh. Interesting. I actually see that we have a frozen pea shooter. I think that's what that is. Well, that's the only thing that would make sense. It's literally a snowflake icon, but let's test it. Let's see. Okay, yeah, his face gets like a little blue effect. Actually, his entire sprite does. I'll place a walnut right there to block that guy. What the f what is this guy? Oh my God, wait, is this the, is this the, uh, the football guy? I think it is. Ain't no way, wait, can he jump over plants? Ah. Oh. No, he can't. This game just feels so much better than ChatGPT's. I'm not even trying to glaze Gemini like that, but like, this is so much better. All right, let's try level two. Let's try level two. This is the sunset, sunset level. Very cool. Start off with some sunflowers. Oh crap, we can get three. Very nice, very nice. I'm loving, I'm, I'm actually really liking this. We're gonna have to sacrifice a lot of lawnmowers here. Oh, cherry bomb, cherry bomb. It's not placing cherry bomb. Yeah! So now that we have all of these plants, world one and two work perfectly. I think the next logical step is adding more worlds. We go for like three more levels. I, I want to ask it to have new plants in every level. Maybe that's a bit too ambitious, but hey, I'm pretty confident Gemini can handle just about anything. Add three new levels. Each level should have some unique new plants as well as zombies. Make the sprites more detailed, especially for the zombies. And that's just going to be that prompt. Quite simple. Still have 12 minutes left, so shoot, we might have room for about two more iterations after that. Okay. All right, bet it's done with a new code. Boom. It added 20 lines. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's see. Ooh, level five boss rush. Okay, we had a, we got a boss fight apparently at the end. But I have a feeling it removed a couple of things because the the amount of code went up by 20, so it had to have removed something. Whoa, what the what the what the heck? <laughs> Oh my god, we have so many plans to choose from now. Oh shoot, wait, the sprites are a little more detailed. Zombies are looking a little cursed though. Anyways, let's uh, see what this is. Uh, uh, what? What the heck was that? Yo. Bro, what? Okay, what is this spike thing? Spikes? This is a spike trap? I'm actually, I'm actually kind of liking these changes then. It actually isn't even that bad. This one that's like two green balls. I mean, I can only assume that that's the um, freaking double pea shooter or whatever you call that i don't know but i'm gonna wait to test this on the next zombie that spawns or not we just beat the level frick <laughs> try level three i can see some particle effects like right here but they're only like for the top part of the screen place a pea shooter place a pea shooter oh crap this football zombie is going down the only lane that doesn't have a lawnmower not looking too good what do i do uh spikes what dude that did like no damage no I was expecting that to be like a one-shot kill. No. All right, let's try level four. Cherry bomb. Oh, dude, I thought that would have killed this one too. God, I just wasted a cherry bomb for no reason. All right, come on. We got to start getting these sunflowers in place. Okay, we got it. We got a decent sunflower farm going on here. Chili pepper. Dead. Dude, that is so broken. It literally kills everything in a row. Oh, I'm about to win this already. That was so easy. I'm going to just chili pepper this. Now let's uh, do the boss rush level. Don't really know what to expect here. Here's the boss. I wonder if I can one-shot it with the chili. Dude, these are so broken, bro. One minute left. So you can get, we can get one more prompt in. I mean, the obvious thing that would need work is like the menu, of course. Make the menu a lot more polished and juicy. Make the plant sprites all more detailed as well. That's really about it. Like I'm, I'm pretty satisfied with how the game is right now, so. 
There's the timer. Oh, wow, well, look at that. It actually added lines of code instead of removing. But frick, dude, let's give it a run. Oh, yeah. Wait, dude, this looks sick. Nice little uh, spiral background with the uh, new button icons, bro. These look clean. Let's see if these sprites are more detailed. Bro, just made it look cursed. Why does it look like that? Ooh, the walnut looks nice. I like the walnut. Some of these hit, some of these don't. I'm really curious to see what the frozen feature looks like. Let's see. Oh, I should have known. It literally looks the same. <laughs> it literally looks the same as the feature. Let's uh, see what the double feature looks like. That actually doesn't even look that bad compared to the normal feature. It looks. This looks a lot better. Uh, let's see what the chili looks like. Bro, it looks the same. It looks the same exactly like what it was. Cherry bomb. Oh, that was that was really good, dude. That actually looked so good. All right, well that wraps it up for Gemini, dude. Not bad, not bad at all. Now, which game do we think is better? Huh, this, this is a hard one. When you see ChatGPT's like environment, looks a lot better than this. It looks a lot better than this. But literally like everything else, Gemini just does better. Honestly, some of the sprites on ChatGPT's are a lot better. And ChatGPT's is also kind of like animated when they shoot. Like look at the pea shooter's mouth when he shoots. It kind of like changes, you know? But hey, I mean, I guess it's kind of just personal preference. But I'm gonna have to go with Gemini just cause it feels better to play.